In this film, we'll take time to look at one painting and explore what happens when we bring mindfulness approaches to the experience of looking at art. Mindfulness is coming into the present moment and noticing what you can sense in your body, in your mind and around you. Research shows practicing mindfulness can boost our mood and sense of well-being. Bringing mindfulness to looking at art can deepen and enhance our relationship with an artwork and with ourselves. What if you took time to be fully present with one picture, opening up to your direct sensory experience? For the next few minutes, we'll focus on one painting in the Wallace collection and explore three aspects of looking with mindfulness. Awareness, focus and connection. You're going to hear from me, Carly Allen, and from Lucia van der Drift as we guide you through this practice. Find a comfortable position where you can sit quietly without interruption. Feel both your feet on the floor. Sense your weight in the seat. Simply aware of your body as you sit here. This painting is by the 17th century Dutch painter Schalken. It's a small picture which shows a woman threading a needle by candlelight. You may have questions or associations that are sparked by this painting. For now, see if you can let go of these and simply come into your sense of sight. Let your eyes come to rest on the picture in front of you. The first aspect of mindful looking we'll explore is awareness, simply acknowledging what's here and just being with what we see. Lucia will be your guide. So we're resting the gaze on the painting without making any effort and then starting to look at the background of this painting, the darker area around the main figure here, just taking it in, noticing all these darker spaces that make up the background to this painting, in the foreground as well on the right hand side and above on the left and then also noticing any darker areas on the figure that is the object of the painting any shadows and then also looking at the lighter areas of this painting, you can see the candle as our illuminating point. Noticing any lighter areas. The candle itself on the hands perhaps and on the face. And maybe also noticing that light reflected back on her earring. And then, whenever the mind goes into narratives or interpretation, maybe just gently bringing it back into the simple looking and observing. 
Now finding different colors in the painting, finding white and then yellow tones, maybe we find some blue and then also noticing any red, for instance, on the tablecloth or her garment. And then there is also some red and pink on this girl's face. Moving now to looking with focus gathering our attention to a narrow point of focus, holding the attention in one particular place and bringing the mind back when it wanders. So follow the woman's gaze to her hands, where she's fully absorbed in this task of threading the needle. her fingers and thumbs in contact with each other. Notice her fingernails. Her knuckles. Any creases in her skin. and turning to the palms of her hands in shadow. And the backs of her fingers in the light. When your mind gets pulled away by thoughts Come back to simply looking here. Now at the tip of her little finger. Tracing a line around her finger. And now letting your eyes Follow the outline around her hands. Staying with your looking. Staying with this outline of the hands. And perhaps you can discern the line of the needle and the thread that's being drawn towards it. Perhaps you have a, a sense of where this is being held. Place your full attention here. before letting go of this narrow focus. In the final stage of this practice, we'll tune in to the quality of connection that can be brought about by looking with mindfulness. Lucia will be your guide. So we're widening our focus, taking in the whole painting again, resting the eyes, gently 
on the painting. And as we are looking at this painting, just noticing how you feel. How do you feel? And now, again taking in that woman sitting there quietly in the night. I'm inviting you to send her through the centuries, sending her your kindness, your well-wishing. And then in turn, imagining receiving kindness from her, just receiving it, coming into the heart, coming into the body, and then resting your attention on her face. And now feeling your own face from the inside. As you're still connected to this painting. And now returning your attention to your own body. Returning the attention your own thoughts bringing the attention to the breath and just following the breath for one cycle and when you're ready disengaging from this slow look at this painting. Broaden your awareness now to take in the space around the painting, knowing you can always return to look again another time. Many people find they see art differently when they look with mindfulness. Perhaps a heightened awareness of colours. A deeper personal response. Or a sense of a greater space in themselves for creativity or joy. We hope you're able to bring these mindfulness approaches to your encounters with art and, with practice, enjoy the benefits of looking in this way. Thank you for joining us.